Panka has been hyped up since episode one in the ending specifically, right? Because there's a whole ending dedicated towards her and she has like a little dog collar that she wants to give to us, right? It's, we, we are her little slave, but she popped the fuck off. Like she has been super hyped. Everyone's saying, don't worry because she's here. Like some all night shit, you know? She shows up, her powers are insane. Spatial distortion. She can like fucking send like a black hole to you. You can pop up out of everywhere. It's fucking crazy. No amount of defense means anything if you can just send someone in the black hole but if someone else also has spatial powers and it's in the humanoid side right there's like this lolly snake uh yeah he may kind of type and there's this huge you know jacked you know amazonas type and there's also the person that got sent in the black hole but I'm not sure where we're going with this because we're at Tenka's place right now. She's like stalking us. She's like looking at us while we're sleeping. And the deal is we're supposed to like trade, right? Kyoka's like, all right, you can have like Yuki for today. So what's going to happen in today's episode? Let's find out. Yeah, what do you want to do? Okay, flexing. She's just flexing. Her life is so perfect, but her like private sex life and other shit is so boring. She needs a Yuki to like step it up. Is that why she's had that dog collar saved up this entire time? A pet. Okay. Define relax. What do you what do you, what do you mean relax here? Huh? Can I see this? Make you happy. Mm. Happy endings? She's bribing Kyoka, dude. <laughs> That's the most important thing to Kyoka, right? Supreme Commander position. No, it didn't work. It, it, I, I know it's just military terminology, but like, damn. I'm going to become Supreme Commander on my own, right? And then she says, what does she say right after, right? Not by leveraging one of my inferiors. That feels kind of bad. Inferior basically means subordinate, but damn. Did you have to really say it like that? Dating? Dating? CGI wheels. Yeah, little slave, she wants you. She straight up poured it into her bedroom and looked at him while he was sleeping. Private life. Relaxing. Make her happy. Yeah, what about it? But I feel like... What does it mean that she wants us? Little slave. Pet. Oh, here she is again! Is she porting too soon? Yeah. Hello. <laughs> this time she came when we were like awake. Uh huh. Yo, this piano theme playing right now is fucking so sick. It's so hype. This piano riff. It was playing when she was like doing the black hole stuff and everyone's like popping off. But like, it reminds me of like the Limitless Gojo theme. You know what I mean? I feel like this is the wrong time to use the soundtrack though. It's like a fan service moment, you know? You have a crush? On a pet? Can we trust her? Can we trust her? Boyfriend? But she said that she wants a pet, and now she's saying that she has a crush on us? No, but I feel like we're getting played, man. Are we gonna get our heart broken? Is she playing us? She said pet. Cap, she's lying. Pet was a figure of speech, and so you're so adorable. Nah, she is playing at us like a fiddle. Every one of you in chat already fucking folded, and I don't blame you. I already folded before any of you. Okay, back to the piano riffs. <laughs> Bravery? Yeah? Ooh. <laughs> oh. Yeah? Young and cute can do household chores? Mm. And then what? Maybe just one day she'll spoil us, guys! Oh, oh, oh! She already stole a kiss? That's a fucking speed run! What else is racing? Yeah? Oh, 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 we're going in. We're, oh, oh, oh! Wow! Yes, ma'am? The right way? <laughs> you poured it into her fucking room and you're on top of us now? Okay! Shirt or pants first? No, ma'am! Take it off! <laughs> you, you can't just be using your black hole like that casually. Imagine. I know she has like, complete control over it. Could you imagine if there's like a little accident here? Oh my god, you keep dead. Wait, why are you getting in this position? Tank is gonna get the strap out if you assume this position, bro. What, what, what? Uh, hello? 
<laughs> this looks like it's a time for your fucking prostate exam. What's going on here? You, ain't no way you just said I'm trying to see her black hole. <laughs> okay. I'm in. Oh, oh look, 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 look at the grip. I'm in. <laughs> Oh my god, what is this position? <laughs> Something else is slipping away. Oh! <laughs> Not now! Not now! You're getting cucked, Shushu. Get out of here. <laughs> Shushu cucked. Cock blocked. Yuki's quite muscular though, huh? She actually did pounce him. Did she just blame it on the little slave spell? Ain't no way. I must have been under the little slave spell. She just so down bad. Ain't no way. You know all the girls are jealous though, right? Never abuse her abilities, huh? I mean, all she did was... No, she did use it to port over here and then rip her shirt off. Watch her just teleport back home. And then like, no, sorry, back here, you mean. I'll see you like an hour. Bye bye. That tank of position was. Goddamn. Goddamn. You know, of all the girls, Kyoka cares the least. Shushu, he might look pretty jealous, huh? But like, Kyoka, no fucks given. I guess she's too busy on the, the Sigma grind, right? She's trying to become a Supreme Commander. Unless she's hiding it really well. But like, so far, I see like no jealousy, right? Just from Shushu and Himari, I see it. Nene. The title was named after Nene. What's going on? Oh, oh. Nice theme. Lending the slave ability so other girls can use it. And they'll have different forms, right? So like, I was confused because like, Himari obviously transformed him. But she like, her skill is literally copying, right? But Kyoka can literally like, lend her skill to others. Is this possible for other people too? Or is it Kyoka only that she can, like, uh, transfer skills? Wonder what would happen to Yuki when Nene rides him? What would happen when Nene rides him? Would he become... I don't know. Something ridiculously funny. Would he turn into something super cute? Himari... Somehow... Himari and Speed, I don't really make the connections, right? I don't know. How, how is that gonna change? Alright. Yoink on the chains. Hmm? Is it gonna turn all cute? Huh? Oh, he kinda did. Kind of. Looks like a Power Ranger now. Eternal Chain Slave. Shining Star. Alright, new mode. Cool, cool. We got three separate modes now. Looks like a boxer. Just, just a boxer? Mixed star martial arts? I don't know. What do you specialize in? Not strong, not fast, slow. Senses are sharper. Right, because Nene's skills are basically vision, right? She can scout. So somehow that is applied here. What did you just do? Wait, 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 wait. What did he combine there? If I use my brand break trick and channel energy into my eyes. Brand break was, uh... What uh, what, what was brand break? What, wasn't brand break the one-shot skill that we learned with Himari? Yeah. How the fuck is... How are we combining it? What do you mean? How are you all... How are you channeling that into your eyes right now? Anyways. Combining the brand break, you know, putting into his eyes. Now you got x-ray vision. Well, not really, but you can see it. The, you know, the, the bra, the panties. <gasps> Okay, this this is why you guys told me to go to kick today, guys. So good call. Good call, guys. Whew. Save save the band. <laughs> uh, they don't know. Don't don't bait. Ah, uh, you fucking reported yourself. Shushu like that. Shushu actually like that. Okay, so lending makes her super drained. Now, what happens when Shushu rides them? Oh, thank you, eleven-year-old senpai. That's the reward. Like, just leave it at that, right? Just innocent, pure, cute. Just leave it alone. 
Head pat, move on. This is actually cute, you know? This is actually cute how she's like... It was like a, such an innocent kiss, but it's like... Even then, she's like embarrassed. No, other people still... You know, they're the ones that... Gives the reward. Okay, Shushu, now, you! Are we gonna turn huge? Yeah. Is Yuki gonna... Grow fucking huge then? Mm, I think she wants that extreme reward, though. She's down. I think she's down. See? See? Imaginary reward already. This is almost a tanker position, but, you know, we were the other way around. This is going to 69 position, man. All right, yes, ma'am. Let's go. Okay. A silly reward is the thing that's getting you going. All right. Let's get huge now. What mode will this be? I love how the chain is like the fucking lawnmower starter. You got to fucking rip the core like a Beyblade. All right. There's big mode. Eternal Chain Slayer. Iwatushi. I don't know what the fuck that means. Big. Strong. Tanky? Slower, but sacrifices for uh, strength. Bulkier, stronger, slower. Hmm, let's try that. Water just... I, I don't know. Will he get bigger? Or will she just... Yeah, exactly. Exactly. I'm like, will he actually get bigger? Or is she just gonna sit on him? Yeah, we're just gonna get sit on him. Hey, this ain't too bad either. Did she broke his arm? I don't know what that is. He's got little bands. Well, maybe Shushu's form, it'd be very useful. Like, every one of them has, like, a specific mode, right? Nene's obviously vision, Himari's speed, Shushu's strength, and Kyoka's overall just general jack-of-all-trades. So, if there's ever a situation where we need, like, a one-shot kill technique, then I feel like Shushu's mode is the perfect thing, right? As long as they can have it, like, chained down and we can just, like, hit a guarantee. Now, what happens when Kyoka lends her powers to Tenka and Tenka rides Yuki? What the fuck would happen then, right? Because these so far, these powers are pretty easily, like... Because like, it seems like the, the mode is directly reflective of the user's powers and some of their themes, right? But if Tenka uses it... Tenka uses fucking space shit. How the fuck is that going to transition to us, huh? I don't know. School? School? Oh, right. They're students. I thought we'd just stay here. I forgot to have a regular life outside of this. I forgot. <laughs> yeah, why would an 11 year old just join? But what normal 11 year old kid would ever think like this? Here we go. Finding parents. Missing parents. Okay. Sad flashback. You think the parents could be humanoids by now? Or they just kept hostage? People get phone calls? At Based on people vanishing? Is that a fishing scam? Fine parents. That makes a lot of sense. Right! Because there was a theory last time, right? I don't know. There's a Super Saiyan sleepy girl was like, all right, people's like feelings and like their personalities, that's what influences their powers. It's not like a peach is like a specific devil fruit that like gives you RNG powers. It's like, it's all related to your own motivations. Sure to find. Promise. <sighs> we gotta protect that smile, but what if her parents are already dead, man? Are there, I don't know. What would the parents even be doing? Are they all in a jail cell? Or are they becoming humanoids? Like, what do you mean? They're just missing, right? They're either dead, they're locked up, but what good reason would we have to lock up their parents? Or, maybe they turn into, like, humanoids. I don't fucking know. Uh, your big sister is out there! Maybe the... Parents are out there too, as humanoids, who knows? CGI leaves in the- I see those CGI leaves. Supreme Commander! Yo, I want to meet a Supreme Commander. Gather all command- How many commanders are there? Yo, I want to meet them all! Yeah, we got a little bit of an alliance, this is nice, right? We got Kyoka and Tenka, but damn. There's so many commanders and a Supreme Commander. Ho ho ho. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa. Hello? Hello, it's me, little slave? Oh, yes, ma'am. Of course I will. Oh, she's already here. She's teasing, man. What was that? She fucking blows in her ear. Suddenly he drops the cup, goes to his crotch. 
And then the hand just fucking goes right. In I feel like, you know, this is all intentional right now, man. If she fucking grabs the cup and like caresses it near his fucking dick, I'm gonna fucking lose it, dude. No, no, not none of this? Okay, never mind. <laughs> You're always teasing. Nay, Nay, close your eyes. Nay, don't close your eyes, Nay. How do you test the alcohol? Uh oh, what? So before the alarm there, see how I was talking before about how Kyoka seemed to have not like affection for Yuki? But like so far, she's put up a pretty good poker face, right? There's not a single moment where I thought that she like feels jealous, but like this part. You. Mm, this kind of like hints that maybe she does care, but she's just not showing it because she's obviously too focused on her goal to become Supreme Commander. I wonder how she really feels about Yuki. Oh, our alarms are going off. Who is it? Humanoids or regular? Yuki. All right, can Tenka come with? Now come fight with us. All right, just random mobs. Hey, we should use your new transfer abilities. Yeah, Tenka. Yes, you should. Man, I want to see Tenka pop off though. Thank you. Man, this is perfect to transfer power to Tenka and Tenka ride Yuki, you know? Okay, so this is confirmation. Why would Kyoka be in a bad mood, right? Unless she's actually jealous of all the different girls, you know, having their time with Yuki. I think she actually does care. She's been putting a bit, like a very good poker face this time. Is she gonna treat us more aggressively? Oi. Yeah. Uh, okay, well what? It's not my fault, she's too hot. You blame me? You're my slave. <laughs> but like Tenka calls me her little slave. You know, I want to be her little slave. But all right, we're her slave. All right. No more cheating. Okay. <laughs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> He's so happy about it too. No, I'm not giving up on Tenka just yet. I mean, these are just random fodder, you know, so who cares, right? Whoa! Random fodder getting beaten! Oh no! Himari might die, guys! What is that? Wait? It's all combined. Didn't we see something like that happening? Didn't the bunch of Shuki try to combine a couple episodes ago? I forget. Oh, and it grows back! Wait. Put what to test? We got a new move? Combination attack? Ooh, that was a crisscross! Mighty blade cross! Hey, we got a name technique too! So, like, what determines if they turn into blue flames or not? Oh, wait, I just paused. This girl! That's a snake girl! That's a snake lolly, but like, what determines if like a Shuki actually dies? Because we cut its arm off, but it kind of starts to like heal back up, right? So there's like some kind of like core we have to like cut, and then they actually turn into blue flames. I don't really know. Anyways, we got the snake lolly here. Hello. Augmented Shuki was the combined one, yeah? <sighs> Girl's design is crazy, man. This girl's design is crazy. I hope she doesn't get fucking one shot. I hope she's not fodder, man. Reward. Reward. Yeah, you shit on us and got hyped up. Now reward. Come on. Give me it. Step on my balls. Come on. In front of Tenka. Let her watch it. Hmm. Oh, the piano riff. We are a slave at heart. <laughs> Basically, you truly are an M at heart, but it's like the wording, bro. The fucking wording. Especially on February. You know what month this is? This is crazy, dude. Holy shit, Tenka. Let me spice up your private life. Give me a little tongue motion. Come on, give me a little tongue. Give me a little lick. No? Fine. All right, Nesan, teach us. What do you got for us? Okay, here we go. Okay, I'm a number 20. Okay. It's 
it's gotta be 50 kilometer radius so it's not just like any long distance forever yep. that's right that's like the black hole stuff she hails from the shimane prefecture and her hobbies include asset management <laughs> basically she's rich as fuck <laughs> she's like a billionaire okay <laughs> what kind of regular person's hobbies is asset management <laughs> she likes almond cake though okay reunion coco lick and that is today's episode i thought it was supposed to be a nene episode based on the title but goddamn it was pretty much just tanka just popping off oh my god my favorite part was not when she got on top of us like this but probably this part oh my she, she is actually on top tanka is actually on top bro holy shit she's powerful she's strong her personal life might be a little bit boring, but that's how we come in, guys. We are little slaves, and she loves the fact that we're such a good little slave, dude. I don't... Because, like... I, I, I don't really know where they're going with this plotline of Tanka being super thirsty, but somehow I'm sure she's eventually going to ride Yuki, right? That moment's going to be really cool when we give other girls outside of our group the transfer of power. And for her to use it and for us to get new modes, goddamn. And, and... There's multiple commanders and a supreme commander. We might have a pretty big meeting soon. What does a supreme commander look like, man? It better be a MILF. It better be not a lolly. And hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlists for more content. And until next time, take care.